Hello and welcome back. Today I'm going to take a close look. It's called Shot Color uh, Distribution Tool Slash Dosing Funnel uh, from San Antonio Industry. So this is a very unique tool. So I've been using it for a while. You know, today I'm going to, you know, we are going to take a close look. Comes with a very nice wooden case here. Once you open it, the back of it, you see the Allen wrench. So this is a unique this because you have to adjust the the depth of your uh, I guess this is a shot color I guess so we have to adjust it so we have the Allen wrench hole there so oh uh, you know what let's set this one up and then let's grind some coffee beans and uh, let's see how this thing work by the way this thing is very heavy uh, let's see how much weight so this is about 421 gram so this is solid metal uh, beer quality is fantastic okay just just to solid metal here that's very nicely built very precise yeah i can't wait to try i'm going it. to loosen up the bolt then i'm going to lower the uh the height of the shot collar i'm going to use my allen wrench to loosen up the bolts here at this point i'm pretty much close to the edge okay we're gonna, I'm gonna start with this point. I'm just gonna, after that, I'm gonna lock it in so it doesn't move. Okay. Okay. At this point, as you can see, the coffee grinds are pretty much almost the top. At this point, I'm going to start spinning the shot color there. Make sure everything is nice and even. I'm just going to do the gentle tap as well, just spinning around. So we just do so at 18 grams. So you're going to be look something like this. It looks pretty good to me. Okay, nicely, evenly distributed. I mean, it looks not bad. Not perfect, but this should be good okay at this point you can use your like you know some kind of wedge tool some kind of distribution tool if you want to but in this case I'm, I'm just gonna skip it and just go to the the palm temper now we have very clean edge so now we are ready to brew One bad thing about uh, using the shot cutter, there's no good way to direct those from your uh, niche grinder, if you have a niche grinder, okay? There's no great way to do that. So you, unless you have to hold uh, uh, your pore filter or you have to put against some uh, something else. I mean, like this one, I just against my the block part here, but yeah, there's no good way to do it. Overall, this is really fun to use. I hope this video helps. If you, ha uh, if you have any questions or comment uh, down below, I'm going to see you next time.